Hello friends, welcome to my channel. We will talk about thyroid disease and pregnancy. So please watch this video till the end to know the complete information. Thyroid disease is a group of disorders that affects the thyroid gland. The thyroid is a small, butterfly-shaped gland in the front of your neck that makes thyroid hormones. Thyroid hormones control how your body uses energy, so they affect the way nearly every organ in your body works, even the way your heart beats. What role do thyroid hormones play in pregnancy? Thyroid hormones are crucial for normal development of your baby's brain and nervous system. During the first trimester, the first three months of pregnancy, your baby depends on your supply of thyroid hormone, which comes through the placenta external link. At around 12 weeks, your baby's thyroid starts to work on its own, but it doesn't make enough thyroid hormone until 18 to 20 weeks of pregnancy. Two pregnancy-related hormones, human chorionic gonadotropin, HCG, and estrogen, cause higher measured thyroid hormone levels in your blood. The thyroid enlarges slightly in healthy women during pregnancy but usually not enough for a healthcare professional to feel during a physical exam. Thyroid problems can be hard to diagnose in pregnancy due to higher levels of thyroid hormones and other symptoms that occur in both pregnancy and thyroid disorders. Some symptoms of hypothyroidism or hypothyroidism are easier to spot and may prompt your doctor to test you for these thyroid diseases. How does hypothyroidism affect the fetus? During the first few months of pregnancy, the fetus relies on the mother for thyroid hormones. Thyroid hormones are important in normal brain development and growth of the fetus. Hypothyroidism in the mother can have long-lasting effects on the fetus. Untreated hypothyroidism during pregnancy can lead to miscarriage, premature birth, low birth weight, preeclampsia, dangerous rise in blood pressure in late pregnancy, thyroid storm. A sudden, severe worsening of symptoms. Untreated hypothyroidism can also lead to complications of high blood pressure in pregnancy, poor growth of the baby and premature delivery. You will require regular thyroid function tests in pregnancy to ensure you are on an appropriate dose. If you have active hypothyroidism, you will still need to take antithyroid drugs during your pregnancy. These drugs cross the placenta so the lowest possible dose will be prescribed so that your baby is less likely to be affected. Hypothyroidism Treatment During Pregnancy Thyroid hormone replacement is used to treat the mother. Dosage of thyroid hormone replacement therapy is based on the individual's levels of thyroid hormones. Thyroid hormone levels may change during pregnancy. And the thyroid replacement dosing may also change. Thyroid hormone levels need to be checked every four weeks during the first half of pregnancy. The treatment is safe and essential to both mother and fetus. Routine screening for all newborns includes a test of thyroid hormone levels. If you have mild hypothyroidism during pregnancy, you probably won't need treatment. If your hypothyroidism is linked to hyperemesis gravidarum, you only need treatment for vomiting and dehydration. If your hypothyroidism is more severe, your doctor may prescribe antithyroid medicines, which cause your thyroid to make less thyroid hormone. This treatment prevents too much of your thyroid hormone from getting into your baby's bloodstream. You may want to see a specialist, such as an endocrinologist or expert in maternal fetal medicine who can carefully monitor your baby to make sure you're getting the right dose. Thank you watching my video. See you in my next video.